It's Wesley from The Post, and I wanted to do a quick video tutorial here on how to use a flare coat, which is a new technology that I'm sure you've all seen when you picked up The Post today. If you haven't seen it yet, if you grab a copy of today's paper, above the fold, next to the flag here, we've got this really awesome QR code um, with a little insignia in it. That's called a flare code. Now what you're going to do is you're going to grab your smartphone, your mobile device, and it's going to bring you all the content, not only from today's paper, but also from our buddies over at WAB, everything they're producing. So let me walk you through it really quickly, exactly how to use this flare code. So go ahead and grab an iPhone here and go to a QR code scanner, a QR code reader. Um, mobile devices, whether it be a Droid or an iPhone, any smartphone should have these type of apps. Hit your QR code, go to the camera button, and then all you've got to do is you've got to maneuver your code into this white box. It's really easy. It'll probably do it before I'm even ready. There you go. Click launch website. And from there, it's going to bring up what is our post WOUB flare code. Now, as you'll see when this loads, this is a feed of various um, content streams from both the post and WEB. For example, if you click on WEB video, you're going to get all the video content they upload to their YouTube page. In the same way, if you click over here, we'll click on WEB News. This is going to take you over to the WEB News Twitter feed. So all of the stories that they're tweeting out during the day, breaking news alerts, um, various feature stories they're working on as a, in association with Newswatch and their other programs, that's going to populate itself here on the WOUB news page. Um, here it goes right now. So you've got different headlines throughout the day with links built in. You know, here's the Ohio um, Romney leading the presidential poll story. Various stories that are now populated here and you can access them and comment really, really quickly and really easily. So we'll go back to the main code. Same thing goes if you click over here on post video. Now this is going to take you to a feed of our YouTube channel. So you've got our daily rundown that we do every day, um, our video from this MLK Silent March, various videos. This video will appear here in this feed. Um, so that's there as well. The other thing is our, both of our sports staffs have this content here as well, our arts, our culture staffs, um, the different WUB shows. For example, here's a link to the Bobcat Sports Showcase. So if you're really, um, really into Ohio Bobcat Sports, you bleed green and you want uh, to get access to their, their Twitter feed, their um, breaking news, their in-game analysis, you want to make sure you click there. Same thing goes for the post sports um, who are linked over here as well. Um, if you want to get a hold of our post sports content, you can do that via um, the flare code. So again, it's a really easy, really interactive way to get RSS feeds of both the post and WUB. So essentially any Ohio or Athens, Ohio, Ohio University news you want to get a hold of, we're making it really easy for you just to take, pull out your phone, grab any copy of the paper, and get all the most updated, comprehensive coverage. So again, this is a really interesting partnership, and I'm really excited to hear any feedback you guys have. So if you guys have any, any feedback on how the code's working, if it's not working, make sure to reach out to us on Twitter, you know, tweet at the post, tweet at WUB, or reach out to me personally, because we'd love to know how this is working.